Hi everyone, welcome back to the Science Labs at the Nature Museum. I'm Nicole, and today we're gonna to be exploring North Pond with a Five Senses Nature Walk. Let's get started. We're at North Pond, which is right behind the Nature Museum, and we're gonna get started with our Five Senses Walk. Can you think of your five senses? Today, we're gonna use our ears for listening. We're gonna use our eyes for looking. We'll use our nose for smelling. And we'll use our fingers to explore some gentle touch. Today, while we're doing our five senses walk outside, we actually won't be tasting anything. Let's see what we can see. Why don't we get started by using our sense of touch to explore some plants. We can touch plants to learn more about their texture and explore their edges too. Let's see. Let's give this leaf a gentle touch. The top is really, really quite soft. And now I wonder what this edge will feel like. Wow, all of these little V's on the margin, they feel kind of bumpy on my fingers. Really neat. One of my favorite things to check out with a gentle touch is definitely tree. Why don't we check out some tree bark together with some gentle touch? Oh wow, it's so rough and bumpy and I can see some sort of flaky pieces. Ooh, that's interesting. I bet, oh, it's pretty hard. Oh wow, it's really quite hard. I love checking out trees with a gentle touch. This looks like a great place for us to use our eyes for some good close looking. Let's check it out right down here. I see something so interesting. Do you see it? Some ducks. What do you notice? Think about their color and their shape. What do you think they're doing? Yeah, I think they're eating too. Oh, good eyes. Do you think all of these ducks are the same age? I don't think so either. How many of those baby ducks do you see? How big are they? This looks like another good spot to use our eyes. Oh, let's check out right over here. I think I see something interesting. Do you see it? Oh wow, check it out. What do you notice these geese doing? Yeah, I think they're feeding. Really cool. How do the geese compare to the size of our duck friend? Yeah, they're a lot bigger. Excellent observation, scientist. This looks like we can find a great place for listening right in here. I like to make my ears as big as I can by putting my hands behind them for listening. Let's see what we can hear. Wow, I heard some really interesting sounds in there. I definitely think I heard some bird sounds. Did you hear them? I think I also heard some human sounds too. I think I heard an airplane. I love focusing in on the nature of sounds I hear, but we know we'll hear some human sounds too. This looks like a great place where we could use our sense of smell to smell some flowers. And we can often find flowers in parks right near home. And smelling flowers is a wonderful way for us to use our senses to learn more about the plants around us. Let's stop and smell some flowers. Oh, let's give this milkweed a little smell. As long as we aren't sharing this flower with any insect, we can notice a nice sweet smell. Really neat. Also notice lots and lots of insect friends who are also enjoying this flower for its sweet flower juice nectar. Another great way to use our sense of smell when we're outdoors is just to take a nice deep breath and notice the smell of the air. It smells nice. 
We're down close to North Pond, and if you're near water, it's another wonderful place for you to use your eyes to explore. Wow, down there, I see a small bird. Do you see it? That is a small green heron. Ooh, what do you think it's doing with its beak? Look at it poking its beak into its feathers and under its wings. What else do you notice about Heron? Near the edge of the water is a great place for us to use our eyes to observe. And if we look over close to the edge of the water, what do we see here? Who's coming over? It's turtle. What do you notice about the animal? How big is it? Why do you think it's here? A five senses walk is a great way for us to explore outside. Today near North Pond, we got to use our eyes, our ears, our nose, and our gentle touch to explore. That's our five senses walk. I really enjoyed exploring outside with you. I hope you did too. It's so interesting, all the things that we can see exploring right nearby. You could do this type of five senses walk anywhere. So let us know where you go and what you see. Thanks so much for joining us. See you next time.